fire crews. About 45 crew members actually left the scene about 20 or 30 minutes ago. Uh, now it happened inside of this gated community. Uh, calls came in around 7 o'clock tonight for a fire inside of that home. Uh, as you mentioned, Stan on Martingale Lane. Uh, now when fire crews arrived, uh, firefighters, they say they saw flames shooting from the roof and the sides of the home. And you all mentioned no one was home at the time. We learned that uh, the family who stayed in that home was out of the area at the time. So that's the big question. How did this fire start in a home where uh, apparently no one was inside? Now we spoke to uh, Lieutenant Eric Kornmeyer about, uh, you know, anything that firefighters encountered when they got here. He said this was a second alarm fire. Take a listen to what else he had to say. Initially, um, a second alarm was sounded to bring additional resources. Uh, we had to fight from the exterior for several seconds while we established a permanent water supply. Uh, our initial engine showed up and uh, exhausted their water fairly quickly with the amount of heavy fire. Now, this townhome was attached to two other homes, and we've learned that uh, those two homes sustained some fire damage, I'm sorry, smoke damage, as well as some water damage as well. Reporting live tonight in Arnold, Karen Campbell, WBAL-TV 11 News.